Good morning and welcome to the Brendan Morning Show. This uh, song is called Crash by Usher. It's off his new album, Hard to Love. Would you mind if I still loved you? Would you mind if things don't last? Would you mind if I hold on to you so that I won't crash? Morning light, I'm at your door. One last time, and no one's there And drove all night, to beat you home Would you mind if I waited? Would you mind if I... And I really, really wanna love you And I'm really, really only yours Even if it don't last forever I wanna let you know We really had something special It's hard trying to let it go I'm just being honest I'm still in the moment Would you mind if I still loved you? Would you mind if things don't last? Would you mind if I hold on to you so that I won't crash? Up all night, can't let go Won't stop trying Back home, oh, you won't mind if I wait. You won't mind if I really, really wanna love you. And I'm really, really only yours. Even if it don't last forever, I wanna let you know. We really have something special. It's hard trying to let it go. I'm just being honest. I'm still in the moment. Would you mind if I still loved you? Would you mind if? Things don't last Would you mind if I hold on to You so that I won't crash Good morning and welcome to the Brendan Morning Show. I'm your host, Brendan Foy, your guest performer, your regular performer, and the guy who does the music. I've been crazy busy this week. I went to Boston twice. Um, been at a festival, a film festival, doing stuff. Uh, you might be wondering why I'm wearing the suit. I don't even know why I'm wearing the suit, so don't ask. It's kind of a long story. So I hope you enjoyed that cover of uh, Usher's song, Crash. There's two types of music to me. There's music that's cool because of all... I guess there's three kinds. There's the crappy kind. And then there's music that's cool because of the elements around it. Um, and then there's music that is just good because it's a well-written song. Um, and the test of that for me is to grab an acoustic guitar... And if you can play it and sing it, and it still moves you just to strip away, strip down to an acoustic level, then it's a good song. And that's what that song made me feel when I started playing it. It's Monday morning. We're all tired. We had another week. But I want to hit you with a little encouragement for the week. With that, when everything is going wrong, you're being bombarded with whether it's just stuff, the horrible stuff just never stops happening. And, no matter what you're trying to do, you're trying to do something good and everything just keeps coming and hitting you and you can't seem to get it right, that you just got to keep going. I know that's super cliche, but it's true. For example, this, uh, just trying to shoot this, this right here, the Brennan Morning Show, I've just been, oh my gosh, the past few hours have been crazy. But I'm still doing it because, first of all, you have to do it. Second of all, you still want to do it. Um, obviously, there's things we don't want to do um, in life, but... Ultimately, I think I think the end goal, if you're doing something you love, which hopefully you, you are, and at the end of the day, that's what matters, and that's what you got to think of that to keep you going and keep keep your drive up, because oftentimes it's really hard to, it's really hard to just keep going. Like for me, I need to constantly be, like every hour I need to do something productive. Like if I take a day off to do nothing and just chill, watch Netflix or something, it's detrimental, and I know days off are great and everything, and sometimes it's good, but an object in motion stays in motion. So if you're constantly moving, every hour you're doing something productive, or every day, you know, not only, I don't just mean going to work, but I mean like doing something to further your career, whether you're a sports person, you play soccer, or football, or whatever it is, um, you're constantly doing stuff to train and to, and to be prepared. So I have to look at everything as everything I do, even the stuff I don't want to do, as it's all training 
for whatever, whether it's working on my attitude uh, in something that could be non-related to music at, at all. Um, it's training my attitude, it's training my work ethic and helping me see things with an open mind and being able to, to still do things that I'm not too excited about. I don't know, that was kind of a lot to throw on you this Monday morning, but I felt like it had to be said and I feel like people need to hear that. With all that said, I hope you have an awesome Monday. I hope you have an awesome week. My throat is getting sore and tired. Um, I'm going to go eat some waffles because waffles are pretty freaking good. And the reason I like waffles more than pancakes is because a waffle has all like the little, what do you call them, boxes? Like the little indents, right? So when you pour the maple syrup, it just stays. A pancake, you pour all the syrup on and it just it just all falls off and onto your plate and then you waste the syrup and then you gotta lick your plate and look ridiculous. I like waffles because it just stays there and it soaks in. Whoever invented waffles, you're a genius. So that's why I like waffles. French toast is I, but the same thing, it just kind of falls off. So My album drops next month, November 2016. My debut album, Reveal, comes out. It comes out in two parts. Um, reveal, Departure, and Reveal, Arrival. Reveal, uh, Arrival, the second part, will come out two months after Reveal Departure, the first the first part. So be looking for that. My new single, She's a Mystery, comes out the 21st of October, this month, October. Um, and I got a music video coming out for that. So stay tuned. Lots of stuff coming up. I'm super excited. I want to thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the song. I hope you enjoyed my little motivational speech. I will see you next week.